Someone once said that a smart man learns from his own mistakes, but that a truly wise man learns from the mistakes of others. And that's some of the realest shit I've ever heard. And this has been on my heart to discuss with y'all for a while now. Really since the passing of the young brother Juice World. Now, I didn't listen to a lot of his music. I listened to one project. But my young boys did. And they were hurt behind the loss of this brother. And the way they were hurt really reminded me of uh, when Pimp C passed away. And I got to thinking like, damn, like this shit ain't supposed to keep happening. We ain't supposed to keep seeing these people uh, uh, overdosing generation after generation. And it just shows that we're not learning from the mistakes of our predecessors. See, don't emulate, don't just imitate those folks that you revere, that those people that you respect. You need to be trying to elevate yourself above those individuals. Because if you simply imitate or emulate them, that means you're going to do the good things that they did as well as the bad things that they did. And that's not what we're trying to do. We're trying to push this motherfucker forward. So if you're going to study somebody that you respect, make sure you're studying what they did good and what they did bad so you can say fuck that shit that they did bad and you can elevate yourself above them that's how we keep this shit pushing i give you examples i love muhammad ali love him but muhammad struggled with being faithful to his wives i try to do better muhammad Struggle with managing his money. Trusted too many motherfuckers with his money. I try to do better. I love Malcolm X. But Malcolm, in my opinion, trusted Elijah Muhammad too much. And you saw that led to a rift between the two and contributed to his passing, along with the FBI. I love Tupac Shakur. I consider him the GOAT, hands down. But he was not a good businessman. I try to do better. Everything with my company, I try to know every single thing about this shit. You understand? I love Hov. But Hov sold crack. He sold poison to our people. And he knows he was wrong for it. It's part of the reason I like him. He gives me game and lets me know that those were losses, young blood. Those were things that I did wrong, young blood. You should do better. Like he said, like I told you, sell drugs. No, Hope did that. So hopefully you won't have to go through that. He's telling me on the record, be better than me. And that's what I challenge all of my youngest to do. Be better than me. Be better than my generation. Be better than your parents. Look at what all of us have done and do better. Look at the good things we've done and copy that shit. But look at that dumb shit, fuck shit, idiotic shit we've done and put it to the wayside. Y'all OGs out here, be real with the youngest. Tell them about you completely. They need to know not only your attributes, not only your strong points, they need to know the dumb shit you did so they can take another path, so they can go another road. Cause it's on y'all, the OGs and the BGs. It's on y'all, the kings and queens, and the young kings and queens. It's on all of y'all, all of us, to work together to push this shit forward. So as OG, we got to be 100 with these youngest. And y'all youngest, you got to look at us, study us, and copy the real shit, disregard the bullshit. Don't only learn from your mistakes. Learn from our mistakes and be better. Love. Go. Oh. Subscribe to our daddy's YouTube channel, he's the best. Hit the like button, turn on the notifications.